Wake, wakey, wakey, William. Come on, you got a big day ahead. Oh, sorry about that. You got a big day ahead of us. Oh, yeah, right. Come on, Billy. We have that show that you really wanted to go to. Yeah, alright. Um, I'm ready. Hmm. How, do, how come you're ready? Hmm? I was awake earlier, but... Alright, let's go. We are eager to go. Those birds are pretty relaxing today. Mm-hmm. They always are up. Time we're up. Alright, uh... Well, the show is going to be on soon, so... Let's not waste time, and I say we may as well just head there now. What about breakfast, though? What about breakfast? John, you know, Billy needs his food. Yes, I know, but... We can have it after, okay? Yeah. No, we'll go out for food. Then we'll come back, and he can enjoy his time. And he can tell all his friends about it. That sound like a plan, Billy? Yeah, I guess so. Alright. Let me s open the car. Hey, maybe when we're done, we can stop by and grab some ice cream. How about that? Since that's what you kids love. Okay, Mom. Alright. Honey, have you got the car started? Yes, I do. Where's Billy? Billy, come on. Right. <laughs> uh, we'll, we'll, we'll fix that. that. That was that was a silly mistake. Uh, Billy just broke the window. Billy, what I tell you about knocking over the windows? Sorry, it just—it's so breakable. Which car are we taking? We'll take mine. The BMW. Right. Okay. You're in the back, honey. As always. Dang it. All right, let's get going. All right, we flew all well, we drove all the way out to New York, so this better have been worth it. Well, it will be worth it. I, I'm telling you, you're a very intelligent five-year-old. You know that, William? Don't know how, but you are. So, son, where is everyone else? Uh, I don't know. Okay, well, let's see what these have to offer. All right, everyone. <sighs> I'm tired. This is another year of our presentation. Yep, this time it's 19, oh, 1939 presentations, and we're almost at 1940. As we present every year, Bear on a Ball. Roar. Yay! 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 This is the show. Just Billy likes it, okay? So play off. Okay. Now we will now demonstrate what this bear can do. Now he will place on the ball and be play he will be placed on the ball and he will be doing tricks. Look at this bear on the ball! Shaking his hands and everything! Oh, he's doing it one-footed as well! Impressive! Yay! 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 More, more, more! Oh, what's the bear gonna do? He's gonna do a backflip on the ball! Oh, that's amazing! What an amazing flip from the bear, which we call... Bob. You know what? We'll call him Bob. Bob the Bear are the Nervous Downing Tricks. Yeah! More, more, more! Oh, with the side flip! Oh! 
The bear lands on the ball! What an amazing talent this bear, young bear has. I don't know why I called it young, but we've been doing this for the past 10 years, but yes. Alright everybody, that will be enough for today, so we will go pack up now. Oh, but I, I want more! Sorry, Billy, that's all it has to offer. Alright. That was cool. Can't wait for the 40s. Sorry, but I'm gonna have to cancel our contract. But what do you mean? I can't be doing this anymore. I think Bear on a Ball is officially over. I mean, look, I've only got three people attending this year. I don't think I want to be part of this anymore. But you have to be. I'm sorry, but I'm out. You're gonna have to tell them that it's over. Goodbye, Jeremy. <sighs> sorry, folks. We have some really horrible news. What? What is it? Bear on a ball will never happen again, unfortunately. What? No! I need to see more! I need to see more! Please! I'm sorry, we just can't do it. How to go? Uh, went okay. Come on. Come on, Bob. Uh, your heads. Your head should be okay. Here's a soccer ball. Oh! No! They're never doing it again! Damn it! It's okay, Billy. One day, I will make bear on a ball happen again. Maybe just not bear on a ball, but... You have a dancing bear. You're gonna recreate that. Yeah, what's that word? Recreate? It means you're gonna basically do that. You're gonna do that. But just differently. As you said. Yeah. I wanna have a bear. But not on a ball. I wanna have him dancing and singing. So like what you do with your puppets. Yeah, but except there'll be big puppets. And there'll be big puppets. And they can move. And they can... Dance, they can sing, and... So you're talking robots? <laughs> no way. Robots are impossible. But... Really? Well, how... When you open up... Well, your business, and... Your dancing bear business, I'll be the first person to see it. Alright, champ. Let's celebrate your fifth birthday. Yeah, with some ice cream. Okay. Two days later. Finally, we're back home in Utah. Alright. I will start the, uh, well, the school application. Since we couldn't get him in earlier this year. Well, actually, we need him in next year. I'll start the school application, so, yeah. Okay, uh, do you want me to make you some hot cocoa, William? Okay. I'm kind of sad, though. I don't get to see the bear anymore. It's okay. When you recreate that bear show, remember that word that I taught you about, recreation? I uh, will be the first person to see it, William. All right, I'm going to make some dinner. I'm going to go in my room, though. <sighs> Did we do the right thing? Ah, uh, he'll get over it. All right, time to fill out my letter. For the school. Seven years later, after a long period of time, William finally has his first year of high school. Sixth grade. In America, that's the first year of high school. Alright, first day of high school. 
Let's do that again. First day of high school. Gotta get ready. <sighs> Can't wait to see Selena again. Me and her have been dating for two years. I don't know why I'm saying this all out loud, but mm, I think I have a problem. I like to talk to myself, but whatever. Hey, Mom. Hey, Dad. Mm. Hey, son. Uh, ready for your big day? High school? Yeah, sure. Hey, you can invite that Selena girl over after if you want. Okay, then. <sighs> Chill out. Jeez. I just want to go, and I want to come back home, and I just want to relax. Probably go out to the lake, okay? Alright, what's got you up so tight? I'm just tired, okay? I'd like to go. Would you like breakfast, honey? No, I'm skipping breakfast. Let's just go, okay? I don't have time to deal with this. I just want to go to school. Alright, son. Um... See you, um, sweetheart. Uh, I gotta go. John! You know what to do. If, yeah. I know what to do, Sophie. It's okay. Alright, son. Let's get going. Finally. Alright. I'll unlock the car. Alright. You can have shotgun this time. I'm not five years old. I don't care about shotgun. I mean, if it was the actual gun, I would care. Okay, let's just get you in here. Alright, let's get going. Alright, son. See ya. Have a good day at school. Yes, Dad. I know. Okay. Got it. See ya! Alright, time to head in. Alright, I believe this is the math class, so yeah. Uh, why is there like nobody in here? Is there a reason why you're late, William? Uh, no sir. And, sit down. Is there a reason why there's nobody in here? Nobody decided to pick this level of maths. They all went on to a different one. You three are special. You, Brock, and Selena are all special. Okay, I don't know why you want to say it like that, but okay. Yo, what's up? What's uh, up, Brock? Uh, you know what, I'm just going to sit next to my girlfriend, because that's probably a better choice for me. Hey, Selena. Hey, William. So, about that date, yes, yes, we will use my crossbow in the training, okay? Good. I was just wondering. That's cringe. Alright, class, so today we are going to be learning about pie charts and the extra extraterrestrial physics involved with it. You see, this red mark on the pie, that's 25% of the pie. That means we have to use a special algorithm, which is also known as probability. Probability comes in many shapes and sizes. All we know is that we can use PR slash event divided by X. X would be 25. So we times X by the number of PR. So that's out of 100. So we times 25 by 100, and we get 2,500. That's how we get our answer, and then we have to write it in a special way and divide it by each and every single other number. You got that? I have no idea what you just said. Alright, so basically, when we get the A square, the B square, the C square, and the D square, we actually have to combine this one with a different al algorithm. That makes that B5. Alright, C and D square are combined into B5, which is basically solved with this formula. C and B combine as C3, again. F4 is solved with mainly A and B, so we use this algorithm, R-VG2. I just want it to be lunch already, and then the end of the day. Okay, 
whatever. So Selena, you know, we should go to that, you know, a replace sometime. Yeah. Um, uh, maybe not in front of him. Oh, right. What's going on? I thought me and Selena were thing. No, no, we are. It's just me and him are friends. That's all. Okay, then. I believe you. Okay, so then we use a theoretical altitude, and then the bit, and then the F square, and then the theoretical photosynthesis, and then blah, 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 blah. Fourteen minutes later. Bam! Finally got my work done. I handed it to you, Mr. Um, Mr. Wong. Got it. Y'all did. Can we go to lunch now? Alright, let's get going. Uh, the bro doesn't dismiss you. I do. Are you serious? Okay, you can go. Alright. Time to go to the cafeteria. That math lesson was really boring. Yeah, it was. <laughs> You're funny, Brock. Oh. You know, if William is okay with it, you should come crossbow crossbow wing with us. You know, we're practicing for our archery class, so we should come. Yeah, you know, well, yeah. But, but that was meant to be our date, Selena. It's okay, William. We'll negotiate another time. It's just Brock's really funny. Alright, I, I don't know when you're getting out of here. It's so great, because we get lunch and then we get the end of school. <sighs> yeah, my bag's right outside. Why'd you put your bag outside? Eh, I don't know. I just did. I put mine out there, too. I, uh, put mine in my locker. Don't worry, I made sure to grab your bag and put it out there. Yeah, she knows your locker code. Well, actually, I knew my knew your locker code. I got it out for you. Thank you, so. Oh. You got it out. Oh, whatever. Okay, uh... Alright! We're gonna have the best time of our lives. We're gonna go ding dong. Well, we're gonna go knock and ditch on every single house we see. Yep. Mm hmm. Alright. Since it's outside, we may as well come out here. Alright then. Let's go. Alright, so the woods are over there, so we could head in there and then do it. You know? Oh, the doors are broken, as always. Alright, let's grab our stuff. I've got my crossbow in my bag, so yeah. Um, uh, just one one moment, uh, Selena. Me and me and William will have a nice talk. Alright, Brock, you two better not get into trouble. Oh, we won't. Come on, William. Around the corner. We can chat. Uh, I don't know what there is to chat about, but alright. <sighs> Look, you're trying to get with my girl, and I don't care. What do you mean? <sighs> Me and Selena, we've made out before, okay? Tons of times. I mean, we're about to go n next step further into making out. And... You know, since you have anger issues, I wanted to address this to you. She always talks about hating you. She hates you so much. She likes me so much more than you. She loves my lips, and she hates yours. What? Yeah, it's true. Every time she kisses you, she hates your breath. And she also cries afterwards, which is why I kiss her, and, you know, it helps. Well, yeah, we're about to take take this relationship one step further with this cross bowling practice, and then you know I'm about to move in with her, and you know everything's gonna be great. She told you all of this, yep. And she, before, well, right when we got into maths, right, she said, "I hope William does not show up today. I, I, 
I, I seriously hate him heaps. And, you know, he pisses me off. What? It's true. I'm gonna go have a chat with her. Is that true, Selena? You hate me, and you're dating that weasel Brock. Whoa, 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 he's not a weasel, and... Yes, I wanted to tell you, but... Look, I'm dating him, okay? And nothing's gonna get in the way of that. We can still be friends. But we were dating first. That's only fair. Look, it's okay. People come and go, you know what I mean? So how about, you know, I'll just take my bag, and I'll grab your bag, and we can go first. No! I don't wanna! You know what? I've had enough of you. Uh, what are you gonna do? It's not like you can even do anything. Try me. You couldn't- You couldn't even hurt anyone if you tried. You know what I mean? You're pathetic. You're nothing. Give me your best shot. Take this! Oh shit. Selena, are you, are you okay? Shit. She's got no pulse. I, I killed her. I killed her! No. This is horrible. This is great. This is the beginning of everything, William. Everything that you become is me. What? Who are you? I'm a figment of your imagination, William. I'm you. But also, not you. What do I become, then? You become... You become much more. You could become so much more if you just join me. I can make your life so much better. And I can help you with your dream. The bear dream. I'll help you. Well... Alright then. Huh? Where, where did he go? So, did she also tell you that she wanted to break up with you because of your stupid dream about a bear? OH MY GOODNESS! What the- What did- What happened to her? She- She fell over on the concrete. Oh shit, we, we gotta get her some help. SOMEBODY! Help my girlfriend, please! She's in a lot of pain right now. Uh, we'll take her to the nurse. Shit. How did this happen? She tripped on her bag. That's why her bag's sitting over there. She said for me and you to go. When she, she was about to get knocked out, and then she said for me and you to go. You know, hunting with the crossbow, so we'll go. Okay. Can't believe she's dead. What was that? I said I can't believe she hit her head. Oh, right. Alright, we're here. I'll, s I'll start first. Where are we aiming at? That tree over there. Okay. Let me just get the crossbow out. Alrighty, here it is. Alright. Okay, uh... When you're ready. Yep. Hold on, uh, how do I, uh, do this first? Uh, can you just teach me? Because I don't, don't know really how to, uh, do this. Oh, yeah, sure, I'll teach you. Here. Alright, so you do this.
Good. You've done well, William. Done very, very well. Thank you. It was you! Hmm? What are you talking about? You're the one who killed Selena! She didn't die from hitting her head. Well, she didn't get hurt from hitting her head. You killed her! Yeah, I smashed her head into the wall. And her head started bleeding open. I couldn't feel, feel her vitals afterwards. She is dead. You're a monster! You know that? You're a monster! You're gonna pay for what you've done! One day, you will burn in hell! Again, that's one day. And you know what? I won't be burning in hell. Cause you'll be burning in hell first, Brock. For taking my life. My girlfriend away from me. <laughs> Monster! The wild animals will eat you up, so... How about I just drag your body through the forest and... Chuck away the evidence. Time to walk home. All right, I'm home. Let's see what's going on. Hey, son. Uh, how was your school day? And how was your date? School was fine, and my date was okay. Oh, you and that Selena girl gonna be okay? Nah, we broke up. Oh, it's okay, son. We all experience embarrassment from time to time. Embarrassment? What do you mean by that? Oh, it was never going to work out, son. Yeah, sorry, but, you know, you're, she was out of your league. What? You're wearing a different shirt. Oh, uh, Brock let me borrow, let me borrow his shirt. Oh, that's a kind, he's a kind kid. Yeah. How is Brock? He's fine. Okay, well, dinner's gonna be ready, it's gonna be vegetable soup. Vegetable soup. Well, we would have had Selena come over, but, you know. She embarrassed you. Yeah. It's okay. You move on to another girl, then another girl, then another girl. You don't get it. Selena was the one. That's what everyone says, but they're just stupid. Yep, it's true. Kill them. What? You heard what I said. Kill them. But they're my parents. Are you okay? I kill you talking to. Yeah, are you right? Are you alright? If you don't kill them, they will be in the way of your hopes and dreams. Remember when they laughed at you? You're right. You know what to do. Uh, that's it! I'm not enough! Take this! Uh, what the? <clears throat> that's right. What? Sophie! No! Uh, sa! Die. Die! Ah! William, you bastard! <sighs> you bastard! You bastard! Don't you stupid!
stupid kid! You stupid kid! Stupid, stupid, stupid kid! Get up. <laughs> what the hell is your problem? Come here. You're my problems! You don't get to make fun of me. Die! Good. You've done well. Get rid of the body. Police have been called! You are going to jail, kid! Well, Juvie. You can't get rid of me. Yes, I can. Cops are on their way. Well, I'll tell them that it was you who killed my parents. Alright, kids. Beep! That's them here. Ugh. Let me get out of the house. That won't help you. What is going on here? This kid murdered his own parents. No, I didn't. He murdered them. He came in, we invited him in, and he, he murdered them. I'll believe what I see. You guys keep these people company. I'm going to investigate the inside of this place. Oh, shit. He is dead. And so is she, cooking the cutting up vegetables, I presume. Ah, a knife. I can investigate the fingerprints and find out who did it. Investigate their fingerprints. Got it. All right, give me your hand. Fine. Here. Okay, scanned. Yours. Here. Hmm, I've got a bit of a problem. Alright, I've got the fingerprints. Boss, they, uh, they, they have matching fingerprints. What? That's impossible. Every human being has different fingerprints. I don't know how, they just do. Well, let's hear each side of the story and uh, get a better view. Hey. Alright. UTPD, Utah Police Department, 1945, state your, state your, um, information. Yep, state your information. Well, I was, uh, wandering around, and then I found this, this kid stabbing his parents to death. That's not true. Our parents invited this guy over for dinner, and then he came and killed them. So I ran outside, and I, well, he called the cops to frame me. Hmm. What? No, you have to believe my story. Sorry, buddy, but your story isn't very convincing. You're one intelligent kid. Yep. I couldn't even pronounce half the words at your age. Half of those words at your age. Oh, okay. You're under arrest, sir. Ugh! What'd I do? I didn't do it! I'm innocent! I promise! I'm innocent! Tell that to the judge. Well, we gotta board up this place. Doopity doop. Alright, the place is boarded up. Come on, kid. We'll take you to the adoption center. 19 years later. The year 1964. William is 31 years old and serving out his country in the Vietnam War. Alright. We need to be on alert in case they come. William, you grab the sniper out of the box and you keep on guard. Bobby? Yes. Yes, Jones? You... You guard the, the entrance. Got it. And I... I'll keep a lookout. Through this device here. 
Alright, I, uh, I got my sniper ready, so... Guess I can look through. I mean, there's not really much going on, so... Yeah. I just want to get home to my family. You've lost so many comrades. But we can still manage. We'll still manage. Everyone alright? Mm-hmm. Good. Have you ever think about your home, guys? Yes, I do. I have a wife and a daughter. Yes. I feel you. I have a, a wife and two sons, so, yeah. How about you, William? Do you think about your home? I... I don't really have anyone. Well, I do. Her name's C Clara, but... I don't know. My father used to tell me people come and go, and... You know, just... People might move on from me. That's not true. Love can be real, you know. And it's probably the only reason we've survived. The past... How long has it been? It's been nine years. Nine years, well... Three years for you, but... Nine years for me and... You know, Captain here. Oh shit! What, what happened? Look! Alright, Captain, we've got eyes everywhere. Yep, I've got good luck on. That is great. That is great. Uh, 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 I want to go home. They, they took out the blimp. Our most powerful source. We, we've lost. There's no way we could win this. No. I must see my daughter. I must. Shit. They'll find us, and when they do, it's game over tried. We just didn't win. What now? Well, I must go do something. I must say goodbye to this world. One last time. Didn't sound like he made it. Damn it! Why? Why does this have to happen? I don't know. Alright, boys. We've got our gas masks on, and now we can go out and fight. Yep. Alright. We've got our weapons on us, and we should have them in your bags, so, yes. Okay, let's go. We did just launch a missile over there, sir, so we might want to go check that area out. Good idea. Let's go. So this is the area you were talking about. Alright, let's head in here then. DROP ALL OF YOUR WEAPONS! NOW! <gasps> Shit, no! Damn it. Could've used that. We now... ...are your new leaders. You do what we say, or else we kill you. Cause what we are about to do to you is quite brutal. So you might want to watch out. We are going to put you in chairs, and we are going to beat you with spiked sticks to your last breath. 
Now come with us. Put your hands up and comes with come with us. Alright, I've got you. Come on. You are coming with me. No. Idiot. You're a fool to turn your back on me. Huh? Get your weapons! Get your weapons! Where's it? Got it! Uh, no you don't. Sorry. Uh, uh. We got him. Alright. I'll hold off here. I'll buy you time. Give me your sniper. Run. Go home. Are you sure? Just do it. Alright. I'll remember you. Quick, 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 quick. Run, 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 run! Clara? Is, is that you? Clara! Honey, it's me! <laughs> Uh, 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 who is this guy? What's he doing here? Get out of my... Get out of my fiancé's life. No, honey. It's not like that. And... I've missed you. Past year's been really rough. And. Well. I just saying, I really missed you, okay, William? And. You've moved on from me, haven't you? No, no, not at all. I'm ready to commit fully to being married, William. And who's this guy? Who's this jerk? This? You know that dream of the bear, you know, the whole bear thing? Let me guess, you're here to ruin my dream and say it's silly. No, 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 and where are you getting this from? Ugh. Look, he wants to help you. He, well, he's going to help you with your dream. You two are going to be partners from now on, and then you, you start up some sort of business. Laura, I... You didn't know, I know. I miss you too. So, uh, it's good to meet you. William, this is Henry. Henry, this is William. Henry, Emily, meet William Afton. It's good to meet you. As you know, my name's Henry. I do a lot of robotics, so... I should be able to help you. I got into engineering, so... You should probably open this up, you know? So this was your old house, William? Yep, it was. Oh. This house is... is great. It's... It's going to be our new home. Can't wait to live in it. I can't wait to live in it either. And you better help us. Oh, I'll help you, all right. I'll help you with your house. I'll help you with a lot of things. Especially your dreams, since it's one of mine as well. Glad we share the same passion. Glad to help. And we better get that leg of yours fixed up. I can tell we're going to do a lot of great things together, Henry. Yep. Me too, William. Me too.